Dear colleagues, when we discuss Russia's sanction circumvention, brushing of the obvious, tax havens and post-Soviet mafia states, there is a massive elephant in the room, China. Putin and Xi will meet in Beijing today to celebrate many things. Besides the Belt and Road anniversary, they will undoubtedly toast to successful negation of our anti-war sanctions. Total trade between China and Russia hit a new record high in 2022, up to 30%. China might have single-handedly neutralized many of our sanctions by keeping Putin's petro economy afloat and the war in Ukraine going. China replaces suppliers of Western electronic and engineering equipment. Beijing has also helped Russia circumvent the SWIFT sanctions by facilitating more and more trade with Yuan. It is evident that while we attempt to slow down and stop Putin's mass murder campaign in Ukraine, China does everything short of direct weapon sh shipments to help Russia. My question to colleagues from Council and Commission is, you know full well that China's involvement has been discussed in the 11th sanction package, focus on circumvention. And you know full well that your institutions took China out of its scope. How many more pointless sanction packages are you planning to pass then, while the elephant in the room remains, remains unaddressed? Also, maybe you can pass on the message to Hungarian uh, council officials and they could tell us whether Mr. Orbán's and Hungary's position is now pro-Putin, as he's not only blocked another help to Ukraine, but is also the only EU leader present in Beijing today. Thank you.